Welcome to Agenti. If you are new here, be sure to sign up and create your free trial account. Now, log into your account. Go to Agents page from sidebar menus. Click on the new agent button to create an agent. Here you can use the sample agents available to learn, or use the create new option to create one for your choice of website. In this video, we will learn how to create one. So, let's install the Agent e Chrome extension first. Now, go to any website you'd like to extract the data from. For this demo, I am going to use this example HTML page to extract the list of products. Click on the Agent e Extension Launcher icon on Chrome. And a sidebar will pop up with all the options needed, to create your first scraping agent. Click on the New button to add a field. Now. Click on the asterisk button to enable the automatic CSS selector generator for this field. Once the selector is enabled, you can click on any HTML element on page to generate the CSS selectors automatically. The agent e extension will also highlight or suggest the items which has the matching selector. For example, if you notice the yellow highlighted items. I clicked on first product and it also selected the other five product names as well. And we can always click on suggested items the yellow ones to reject, if we don't want. Then we can click on show option to see the extracted result preview. By default, Agenti will extract the HTML. And we can change the extract mode to plain text. Now click on the accept button to complete this field setup. You can also change the name of field, if you want. Similar to this, we can add any number of field in our agent. For example, I am adding this price value in my second field. We can also write our CSS selector manually, if you know how CSS selector works. For example, let me remove this price field and we will add again by writing our selector manually. For that, we would need to inspect this element source HTML. Now, look into the element HTML code and you will see that this lead class holds the value of price, so I can just use this class to define my selector for this price field. We can also extract images, hyperlinks, or any other HTML attributes. For example, let's try with these product images. In order to extract images, hyperlinks, or any other HTML attribute from an element, we need to change the extract mode to attribute, using this ATTR option. And then, just provide the name of attribute needs to be extracted. For example, the SRC attribute for images. Now, let's add one more field to extract the cart link as well. Similar to images, we need to use the attribute option for hyperlinks as well. The only difference is, we need to use the href attribute for hyperlinks, while it was src for images. Now, click on save button to save your scraping agent in Agent e Cloud. The extension will ask you to log in first, so log in to your Agent e account.
Here you can change the name of your scraping agent as well. And click on the save agent button. You would see the successful message with the agent ID. Just click on the agent ID hyperlink to go to the agent page. Here you can see or export the result. Or add multiple URL for batch crawling. We can add any number of pages here to extract the data from similar structure pages. For example, you can create an agent for mobiles category for Amazon and can add the laptops, clothing, or fashion category pages URL here to get the data for all those categories in single agent. Then, just start to rerun your agent. Thanks for watching. Check out other videos tutorials to learn more about Agenty tool, automation, and API.